Good evening, Democrats. It's a high honor and a distinct privilege as a Brooklynite, New Yorker, and as an American to stand before you today and unequivocally express my support for Kamala Harris and Tim Walls to be the next President and Vice President of the United States of America. Over the last few years, House Democrats have been hard at work, and we could not have asked for a better leader to partner with than President Joseph Robinette Biden, who will go down as one of the most consequential presidents of all time. Last month, President Biden selflessly passed the torch to Vice President Kamala Harris, who is ready, willing, and able to fight for the people. Kamala Harris is a courageous leader, a compassionate leader, and a common sense leader who will deliver real results for everyday Americans. Kamala Harris is fighting for our freedom. Kamala Harris is fighting for our families. Kamala Harris is fighting for our future. Together, let's make Kamala Harris the 47th President of the United States of America. In our great country, when you work hard and play by the rules, you deserve to earn a living wage. You deserve to have an affordable place to call home. You deserve to educate your children in a great public school that is free from gun violence. And you deserve high quality, affordable health care, and you deserve the chance to one day retire with grace and with dignity. But for far too many people in our great country, they are struggling to live paycheck to paycheck. And as a result, the American dream is out of reach. Here's the thing. Extreme MAGA Republicans don't care about everyday Americans. They only care about themselves. Our approach, led by Kamala Harris and Coach Walls, is very different. We care about you, the American people. And we will fight hard to make sure that the American dream is alive and well in every single community. Now, the road ahead will not be easy, which brings me to you know who. Donald Trump is like an old boyfriend who you broke up with, but he just won't go away. He has spent the last four years spinning the block, trying to get back into a relationship with the American people. Bro, we broke up with you for a reason. Trump was the mastermind of the GOP tax scam, where 83 percent of the benefits went to the wealthiest 1 percent in America. Trump failed our country during the COVID-19 pandemic. Trump is a chaos agent who is focused on himself, not the American people. Trump tried to destroy our democracy by lying about the election and inciting a violent mob to attack the Capitol. Trump put three extreme justices on the Supreme Court who destroyed Roe v. Wade. We broke up with you for a reason. Donald Trump can spin the block all he wants, but there's no reason for us to ever get back together. Been there, done that, we're not going back. Kamala Harris, Kamala Harris and House Democrats will always put people over politics. Kamala Harris and House Democrats will lower costs and grow the middle class. Kamala Harris and House Democrats will fix our broken immigration system and secure the border. Kamala Harris and House Democrats will strengthen the relationship 
between the police and the community. Kamala Harris and House Democrats will continue to combat the climate crisis with the fierce urgency of now. Kamala Harris and House Democrats will protect Social Security, protect Medicare, protect Medicaid, protect the Affordable Care Act, protect working families, protect small businesses, protect the middle class, protect free enterprise, protect our children, protect our seniors, protect our veterans, protect our unions, protect our dreamers, and always protect a woman's freedom to make her own reproductive health care decisions. The extreme MAGA Republicans want to divide us. But the Constitution promises equal protection under the law. We are one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Together, 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 let's build a brighter future for our children and our grandchildren. In the Old Testament, Book of Psalms, the scripture tells us that weeping may endure during the long night, but joy will come in the morning. Here's how we do it. Strategize on Sunday. Meet the moment on Monday. Take it to them on Tuesday. Work it out on Wednesday. Thank the Lord on Thursday. Fight the power on Friday. Set it off on Saturday. Get a few hours of sleep. Wake up the next day and do it all over again until joy, joy, joy comes in the morning. Now there's only 76 days left. There are only 76 days left. We must continue to speak up. We must continue to show up. We must continue to stand up, not as Democrats or Republicans, but as Americans. And when we do, nothing can stop Kamala Harris from becoming the 47th President of the United States of America. Nothing can stop House Democrats from taking back the majority. Nothing can stop the American people from continuing our march toward a more perfect union. Nothing can stop us. We're all the way up. God bless you. God bless Kamala Harris. May God bless the United States of America.